Or so when you look at the, I guess, first off, what was your thoughts when you heard that Kyrie was suspended and um, how did you find out? Uh, I mean, we, you know, all the outside noise and everything. I mean, I mean, it's tough. I mean, we just had to focus on, you know, keep the focus on the game and, you know, uh, keep, you know, keep our, you know, game plan and discipline to come out and execute to get this win. And I guess in his absence, I mean, you clearly took on some playmaking roles in his absence. I mean, you just touch on how that how it affected you in the game plan and what you were tasked with doing. I mean, just, you know, whatever this team needs from me, I'm going to, you know, try to step up to the plate, whether I got to be a playmaker, uh, scorer, you know, defender, you know, anything. I think, you know, just having that versatility to, you know, impact the game in whatever way I have to, you know, for us to win, that's what I'm going to do. Royce, was the eight assist, was that something Jacques or some of the coaching staff said they'd want to see more out of you, or was that just kind of the, the way the game went? I mean, I think that's just kind of, kind of how the game went. I mean, I think we had, what, 30-some assists overall. I think everybody knew, you know, the ball had to move. You know, the focus going to be on Kevin. So, I mean, everybody else stepped up. I think just, you know, uh, driving the paint, creating open looks for everybody else, and, you know, everybody just being ready to play, step up to the, to every game. Have you played point over four? Uh, I mean, I, I try to play a little bit one through five, you know. Uh, Whatever I got to do, I play point guard, shooting guard, you know, try to be versatile, play different positions. And then what was your view? Uh, I think it was the end of the bench when Kevin had that first quarter point. I mean, that was tough. I think you've seen everybody's reaction. Uh, I mean, whew. it is a great play, great player. And then, you know, that's just how everybody's supporting, you know, teammates. I mean, a highlight play like that. You know, we go back after the game and talk about it in the moment. You celebrate and then keep moving. I think it uh, seems like almost every game we're in here talking about defense after the game and where you guys' failings have been on that end of the floor. Uh, today, on a lot of occasions, you went small, were outsized, and yet this might have been your best defense performance of the year. I mean, how do you explain that? I mean, I think when you're missing guys, um, it creates – you know, opportunity for others to step up. Uh, we knew it was going to be a collective defensive effort, especially rebounding. Uh, I mean, I think our focus on defense really, you know, creates opportunities on offense, and that's what we had to do a focus on today. I mean, every game is a defense. We want to, you know, increase that and make that better every game. I know, obviously, you're not going to have Kyrie for a while. Um, but even when you get Joe, but when Seth is back and when Ben is back, um, are there things that you guys can take from this game and the way you guys kind of rotated and helped the helper and did all of the little things that you need to do to win that you can carry forward even when you guys are close to full strength? For sure. I mean, uh, you know, once we get everybody back healthy and, you know, everybody back, uh, you know, we're just going to keep continue building on, you know, every game, learning from every game. Uh, it's going to be a collective team win. Um, you know, night in and night out. I think our, our focus on defense, we can score, you know, how many ever points, but defense and rebound is something we've been focused on and going to keep getting better at.